to this week's vlog if you missed last week. Basically, I am starting to put effort into YouTube in the year 2024 because I like miss doing long form content. So this is just going to be a vlog week in my life situation. Um, I just got back from the gym. I'm going to make a protein shake, but I wanted to show you guys how to make my protein shake because one is paleo and two, I feel like nobody does this. So I'm just going to show you. Um, but yeah, I just got back from the gym and Jackson and I walk. I'm starving. I think I might even eat more than my protein shake, but I thought I'd show you guys what I put in mind because I don't really see anybody else make this healthy slash delicious of a protein shake that tastes like Captain Crunch. I was just listening to the Bruins game, nine rounds of a shootout, so... Okay, so for my protein shake, I usually use the Truvani vanilla protein powder, but I only have one scoop of it left and it's in my gym bag. So I'm going to use the chai flavor. I don't think it's going to make that big of a difference. This might be like a little bit of a cinnamon overload with what I'm about to do, but it's fine. Um, so I put a scoop of protein powder. I like to do almond milk, um, usually for everything, but I did accidentally buy some oat milk lately, which is the same brand, the milk brand. Um, just because there's like at least a little bit more protein in this for like a little bit of a nutritional value boost. So I'm gonna put some of that in there. I'm gonna put some filtered water in here. Feed protein shake. Like if I wanted like a blender ones, that would, I could do that, but I'm feeling lazy. I do have the little like shaker ball thing in here. So I'm gonna pour this in here. And then the star of the show, these Siete Churro Chips. Okay, then I'm just gonna take like a, that's just keep putting in here. I'm gonna take a handful of these and just kind of break them up and throw them in here. So good. Literally cinnamon toast crunch. I'm not kidding. And then that is, I guess I'll give you guys a better shot of this. That is her. I know it looks like Doritos in milk, but it's delicious. Okay, so I just had two boxes come in the mail. So I wanted to open them on camera because I'm hashtag vlogging now. <laughs> um, I got a package from the Revs for this season. So thank you to the Revs. This was very nice for you. I can't wait to style this for the entire season. Um, the outfit that I'm going to wear to watch Messi play is going to slay harder than any outfit ever. I don't know what that outfit is yet, but it will slay. Um, they sent me an explanation on the jersey for the year. It was inspired by the Boston Tea Party, which I think is super cool. Um, and they sent me some player profiles for the season and yeah, super cute. And then the star of the show. She's so cute. I'm so excited. Like this is such a nice jersey. Like, okay, hold on. Ow. Oh. Anyways, um, the detail on this is so cool. It's like super cute. And a lot of, no offense, soccer jerseys can be ugly sometimes. Ow, that hurts so bad. <laughs> so thank you again to the Revs. Uh, I'm definitely gonna have a bruise from that. So that is sick. Um, I'm going to hang this on my jersey rack immediately. Um, and then I also got this package from Abercrombie. I'm gonna ship. So I've been trying to order things for the trip. I know that that's like not everyone's MO, but I'm whatever. I mean, sorry, I've lost like a bit of weight recently and I just kind of need things right now. And it doesn't look like it, but I got this workout top that I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep. I wanted to know if it had like the, you know how sometimes workout, like, yeah, it does. Okay, see, this is what I was hoping it didn't have. No offense, Abercrombie, like the, you know, I wanted like a shirt like this, 
that I could wear either to the gym or out if I wanted to because my current crop top situation, I don't love it and I kind of want an extra one. I don't know, I'll try it on, TBD. But that was what I was hoping it didn't have. Um, I also got this dress. Maybe, this looks like it's gonna be big probably should have gotten an extra small. See, that's where I'm at. Like I'm used to ordering a small and I've been ordering smalls and getting them and I need an extra small now. <sighs> we'll see, also going to be a try on situation. And then I ordered a jacket because I don't have a light colored jacket and I feel like I find myself wanting one sometimes. This does not look like how it did online. I don't think I'm going to love this. This might have been a massive fail outside of my Rev's jersey. <laughs> Oof. Part try on haul, I guess. Mmm. I can already tell I don't love this. It feels cheap. Which... It's a no from me, dog. Guess I have a return. <laughs> okay. I think I'm probably going to return all of this. So that was kind of a fail, but I'm glad that I opened it on camera. Thank you once again to the revs for saving this series of clips. Also, I just want to say no tea, no shade to Abercrombie. 90% of what I own is from there and I'm not even joking. I'm, this sweater is from there. These items just size down in that dress if you want it and I can't, I can't complain that a workout gear has a logo on it. I just, that's all. That's the tea. It is like exactly 24 hours later. I'm trying to put outfits together to film a video for the revs. I also have a huge bruise on my knee, leg, thigh thing from walking to this bed yesterday. But the other half of my Abercrombie order is here. So, I'm not going to try it on, but... I will show you what it is. I, no! This is not what I ordered. What? Hello? There is no way. I ordered like the matching sweatpants for this sweatshirt and there is just no shot. No, no, mm -mm. hold on, <laughs> I'm not kidding, there is no, you guys, are these not sweatpants? Yeah, they don't have the thing going down the middle. Yeah, I'm right. Like, that is a matching set. And these sweatpants don't have this line down the middle. I'm not insane. I'm not crazy. Straight up, that ain't there. I'm upset. I don't know how to deal with this. Okay, well, I hate these, and I only wanted that sweatshirt because I thought that it was a matching set. I also did not order an extra small. <laughs> Hello? Am I good? Yeah, I ordered those in a small, and these arrived in an extra small. Okay, hold up. Okay, so like once again, <laughs> no tea, no shade to Abercrombie. I just sat on like the chat with them forever, confirmed wrong item, wrong size even, and so I was like, because I, I ordered this to fly in for an upcoming trip I have, just because I felt like I could get more out of a set on a trip. Um, if I flew in it and the pants that I wanted are sold out in my size and now I like, don't need this because what would I need 
this for and I was trying to tell the girl I was like okay well how do I return this in person because I don't have the receipt for this and she was like oh like shouldn't be a big deal I was like okay queen if you say so so hopefully <laughs> the one thing that I bought that I didn't even really need why is this wet Oh my god, this is so funny. Hopefully this baby tea that I ordered is successful. I kind of want to try these on anyway. Like, alright, fine, I'm going to. BRB. Okay. No. These are too small for me and... They are not cute. What a fail. <laughs> I literally leave for my trip in like three weeks, which is plenty of time. I just hate all fashion right now. <laughs> I'm starting to panic. Oh, okay. Slay. Usually I'm not the type to be able to leave my apartment if it's messy. But I had to or I wasn't going to go to the gym. And I just filmed a video and I have so much work to do. And I'm a little bit stressed, but I'm about to eat and do a bunch of work and probably edit the video that I just filmed and clean this up. And I need to finish booking reservations for London. I have so much stuff to do and it's already five o'clock. I'm like a little stressed. Wednesday, Wednesday, uh, February 21st. Last night, I just want to say, first of all, thank you to Vivations and DPA Calm. I am so excited to try these products. I already done for this a little bit, but it's so funny because I almost ordered myself a new gym bag on Lulu last night. I was like, I could just use like a Lululemon bag or like a tote bag or something like that, but they're just not the same. So the fact that I got delivered, uh, this rug's gonna drive me crazy. I'm gonna see it's messed up because of Jackson. Do you wanna come say hi? I feel like you haven't been in this video at all. Come in. Oh, well, you can see a little bit of him. <laughs> He's just... <laughs> Hi. You gotta come for me. If you want to be in this. Hi. You're so nice. Okay, anyways. <laughs> they drove me off this gym bag and this yoga mat, which actually... I might keep this in this bag because I have a really nice yoga mat that I use at home, but my gym doesn't really have anything to wipe your stuff down with. So I might just like wipe this off myself at home. I hope this camera battery doesn't die and take this in here. Um, but if you don't know Vivations, they are a cannabis brand. Ooh, I don't have a white hat so really, except for my Winston cigarette hat, which I try not to wear that often because it was my grandfather's, even though it's my favorite. Um, so this might come in handy, although, yeah, um, I, I just, <laughs> sorry, Bob. Um, but Vivations is a cannabis brand and they sent me some of their products to try out. So I'm super, 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 super excited about this. If you don't know me, I am a huge advocate for cannabis. It actually got me, Sativa specifically got me off of Adderall when I was in college. Um, it's legal where I live. I live in Massachusetts. Okay, so it's been like two hours since my camera battery died. I forgot to check and see if I have this footage, but I'm just gonna continue on to see if I do, and if I do, I do, if I don't, slay. Um, anyways, I think that I was saying that I live in Massachusetts, so it's fine that I am having these products. 
Anyways, I don't know if it caught me saying that I got off Adderall because I started with like sativa gummies and stuff like that. That's just what's worked, with, worked for me, being 100% transparent with you guys. So I am excited to try these. I'll let you know how it goes. I think some of the girls are going to come over. We might watch a movie and make some THC mocktails. Is that a mocktail? Is that a co I don't even know what to call that. THC cocktail. There you go. Just, yeah. Did I already like eat 11 of these? What is wrong with me right now? Uh, but yeah, so I'm gonna put these in a cute little container. Oh, my favorite thing that they sent me is this freaking water bottle. It has a place to stash your stash or one of these or 11 of them because apparently that's what I had for breakfast this morning. Um, quite, quite the package. One of my favorites for sure. So I will let you guys know how these go, how they taste, how they fit into my routine, because I have plenty to try and I'll eat which flavors I like and which I don't. So I'm glad my uh, camera battery is at least semi-charged. I hope that's level. Anyways, I just made lunch. I feel like I have my headphones on in every clip, um, but I decided since I have no dishes in my sink, I have a little time and the lighting's nice, I'm going to prep my Favorite paleo recipe for cookies. I don't know if I'm gonna put it in this video or if I'm gonna run it on socials, TBD. You'll see it or you won't. Um, for lunch, I'm just having, I guess this is like breakfast technically, even though it's two o'clock. I had a protein bar this morning, but um, I'm having some bone broth from like the packet, Better Bones, and then I'm having um, chive and onion grass fed butter with cottage cheese hot honey and like local bread if anyone cares um but i'm gonna make these cookies and yeah okay i just wanted to show the brands i'm using really quick i think i am going to make this like a reel or a tiktok i'll probably run it as a short too it'll probably be up by the time this video is up um but i will put the recipe on the screen once the cookies come out um, but I just buy coconut oil in bulk. I also buy coconut sugar in bulk on Amazon. I'm using these Lily's dark chocolate baking chips. Um, maple syrup also buy in bulk. Um, baking soda also buy in bulk, but it's Bob's Red Mill. So you can get this at like your normal grocery store. Trader Joe's has the cheapest almond flour, the cheapest. So make sure you're buying your almond flour there. Even if you buy it like in bulk on Amazon or someplace like that, Trader Joe's is cheaper. Um, I use these eggs from Whole Foods. And then I also am going to use some vanilla. And then importantly, I usually have this over on that tray. Make sure you're using flaky sea salt. Um, oh, hold on, I have the container over here. Maldon, this brand. Specifically this brand. I even want to buy one of the mini ones to put in my purse. Um, so yeah, those are the ingredients I will be using. Also, oil your pan. Trader Joe's, also cheapest cooking spray. Okay, bye. Hello, good morning. I just got home from the station and the gym. I'm eating a cookie. It's 9.30 in the morning. <laughs> About to clock in on my other job. Um, I'm so tired. I did not sleep at all last night. I am going to go return that stuff from Abercrombie during my lunch hour. I am returning. If you watch my other video. I'm sorry. I'm so hungry. If you watch my other video, I am going to return the Patrick Ta bronzer. Um... I just couldn't get it to work. It wasn't worth it. Too expensive. I'm going to exchange it for something else. I'm also returning the Amika hair food conditioner, like, leave-in treatment. It just made my hair, I swear, drier than when I got in the shower, which is, like, the opposite point of a leave-in deep conditioner situation. Um, yeah, so I'm going to do some work for my other job. At lunch, I'm going to go do those returns and return a suitcase that I bought because it was not what I wanted. I have to go to UPS for that, and it sucks because it's like a four-piece set, and it's massive. I'm going to have to, like, turn my flashers on out front of my apartment to throw it in my car. Um, and then tonight, I'll probably grab some groceries. I did a terrible 
grocery shop at the beginning of this video that I'm sure you shop. I also have to sneeze and I can't speak. I've had to sneeze every time I've turned on this camera this week. There it is, finally. The sneeze I've been holding in on this freaking vlog all week. Every time I've turned on this camera, I thought I've had to sneeze. I'm gonna leave that in here now because finally. Um, I need to do a massive grocery shop, actually. I haven't bought like more than probably 80 bucks worth of groceries in a hot minute. Do I have to sneeze again? Um, <laughs> but I really need to do, like I need protein powder, I need like snacks, I need bev like I'm going to drop Mad Moolah at the grocery store. Maybe I'll make that like an independent video of like a big restock. Um, but yeah, so I'll catch up with you guys maybe while I'm doing those returns. I'll bring my, I, I charged this bitch last night, so um, it's going to be a long vlog. All right, I'm out of here. Oh, I gotta film a video too, it's Thursday. You know what that means. Okay, Caitlin also told me that my comments were off on my first video, so I need to go change that really quick. Okay, bye. For the last 38 years. Wow, where are you from from? Stone, I'm right Oh, yeah. I used to live on Main Street, Stone. Oh, did you? Yeah, I know where the friendly church down the street. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, Stone Jewish. Yeah, right. Oh, look at this. Oh, you can smell. Oh, look, oh, I'm getting off the fire. Okay, it is now Monday and I'm going to edit this vlog, but I forgot to end it. So I just want to say thanks for coming along on my first vlog. I am going to start filming next week's right now. So make sure you circle back then, subscribe so you get notified when I post new videos because I'm doing a Target haul. Everybody loves Target. And they have good stuff right now. I feel like for the last couple of years, Target hasn't had like as good of stuff as they had back when I was like in high school. Try to have some cute stuff right now and some like pretty good prices. So love you guys. See you in my next video. I'm not sure what it is yet, but I have a bunch of them pre-filmed. So okay, bye.